glad to see you all. Thanks for everybody for coming out. It's a great turnout. And I'm being told by Barry and others that we've got great turnouts on the other weekend as well. Campbell has got the sun shining. I don't know what you've got done to uh, <laughs> cast it away. And for me, this is literally a busman's holiday. I just have to be down here. I'm doing the railway branch tomorrow uh, for their rewards. Like, if any of you can get down, I'm sure the uh, railway branch is paid for your, for, your, for your efforts. But it's a great turnout, and I'm so glad that you've uh, managed to pull off this strike. We're going to show first what we mean. You're dealing with one of the toughest employers. They're the toughest, one of the toughest employers in the railway, and they're one of the toughest in the bus uh, sector as well. And the reason they're tough is because they want to screw down your wages. They want to keep you in a position where they make plenty of profit and you have to work harder. And quite frankly, these proposals that they put on the table, these strings and conditions, are entirely unacceptable. The idea that in 2024 that we move to a 48 hour week is absolutely Victorian, it's, it's outrageous and it would be unacceptable to any group of workers in Britain. We fought for decades and decades and decades to get reasonable hours and where we want to be going is into the 30s, into the 35s and 32, not up to 48. So we're never going to accept that as part of a pay deal, we'll never accept that as a new set of conditions. And all the other detailed stuff well, that's the stuff we need to work through direct with the company. So I'll be getting on to Simon Goff uh, later today to say, look, get round the table. If necessary, we'll get myself and Eddie uh, to attend those meetings. But what we've got to show is that we're absolutely determined to achieve our aim to get you on a decent rate of pay with acceptable conditions that you can work with. And we're never going to surrender to these kind of diktats that they're putting up to us today. So thanks again for everything you've done. Keep going, the National Union is completely behind you. We will put more dispute fund payments in your pockets whenever they're needed. We'll get the rest of the union to rally around you. And we're absolutely determined to win in the Southwest for bus workers and win around the country for bus workers. Because you're as important to us as any other group of members. So thanks for coming down. Thanks for keeping doing what you're doing. And let's move this on until we win the day. Thanks very much. Cheers. Yeah.